My name is Ryan Walker. I'm a Connections pastor at Cross Point Church, and I uh, wanted to take a moment and share my story. It's an interesting thing how many of us can grow up in Christian homes, and that was certainly my story in growing up in a Christian home that uh, confessed Jesus Christ as our Savior, um, but really r- live in a completely different way. And really interesting thing that I've come to find out in life is how uh, you can think you're a believer in Christ or a Christian and not actually be one. And um, that's kind of the story of my life is that I grew up in a, a Christian home, one that uh, confess that Jesus Christ is our Lord, but yet uh, live very differently. Um, we were nominal churchgoers. We'd go very uh, sporadically. And um, when I came to the realization that, man, I'm on my own um, here at college and and things are different. And um, part of what helped me see my need for Jesus Christ is I just got connected to a church. Uh, it was there where... Um, uh, I was able to connect with uh, Chan, who's now he's pastor at Cross Point, and so we connected with Chan. And um, uh, during this time, I uh, I realized I was living a double life. I was uh, speaking uh, um, that I love Jesus Christ, that He's my Lord and Savior, but yeah, I live very differently. Uh, the reason being is that my view of Jesus uh, was not the Jesus of the Scriptures. The view of Jesus was that. Um, um, was that Jesus was centered upon me rather than me being centered upon Jesus, where I was the center of Jesus's world, as if I could think that. And Jesus uh, was not the center of my life. And so he was a means to an end. I prayed to him. Um, I asked him for forgiveness, and he gladly gave it to me. What came to a turning point for me was uh, came up to college, got away from my family from South Florida, came up to University of Central Florida, where... Um, Chan was planting Cross Point Church at the time, and God just radically gripped my heart um, by that. Um, I started reading Colossians uh, chapter 115 about Jesus Christ being the image of the invisible God, the firstborn over all creation. For by him all things were created, things in heaven and on earth. And it just goes on to this big picture view of Jesus, a view that I had nothing of. And it says that it was from him and through him and to him are all things. And I had to ask myself, is my life that way? And I could tell you during that time, I actually came uh, to know Christ. I actually believe that Jesus Christ is my Lord and Savior because uh, he saved me from the depths of my sin. My story was not really about me anymore, but it was about God. Um, it was about living for Jesus and, and making him known. And um, in that, um, I felt God's call into ministry. And so uh, everything changed, and that's why I'm here today. So this is my story.